Hello, everybody. This is Ken Jobst with a closer look at Pastor's midweek message that was entitled, How to Find Your Courage. This is a message that's part of Pastor Cosby's series, How to Win When You Don't Fit In. And it's a series of lessons based on the movie, The Wizard of Oz. Our scripture lesson for this particular episode comes from the book of Joshua, Joshua chapter 1, verse 6. In Joshua chapter 1, the leadership reins are being handed over from Moses to his younger protege, Joshua. And in the book that bears his name, in the very first chapter, God tells Joshua, Be strong and of good courage. That's Joshua chapter 1, verse 6. Be strong and of good courage. Now, to be of courage means to be resolute. It means to stand firm. And you know, there's, there's like three different types of courage, three different contexts in which we can find courage. The first of these is the courage of competition. The courage of competition means you, you are in a race and you are competing against someone, or it's your team against the other team. And sometimes you have to have the courage to take the shot. Sometimes we, we, we want to pass the ball to somebody else or we want to, to dither around. But there comes a time we need to have the courage of competition to be able to take the shot and do what needs to be done. The second type of courage is the courage of conflict. Now, we live in a world where there's all kinds of conflicts. There's conflicts from, from small interpersonal conflicts. There's conflicts within ourselves, all the way up to large international conflicts. But we need to have courage in the midst of conflict in order to be able to stand resolutely and to proclaim where, where we are on particular issues. The courage of competition, the courage of conflict, but the most important courage, the strongest courage, is the courage of conscience. And the courage of conscience means to be able to have the ability to stand up regardless of the circumstances and regardless of the consequences, to be able to stand for what is right. Now, very quickly, how do you find your courage? How do you find courage? First of all, you need a vision that believes it. You need to have everything begins with vision. What are you aiming at? What are you trying to achieve? So a vision that believes in your courage. And secondly, a mission that builds your courage. Every day, every one of us needs to be building our courage do some things, you know, we need to exercise our courage muscle and we'll find that God is right there with us as we stand up for what is right. Well, that's a, a, a quick closer look at pastor's message, how to find your courage. Hope you have a great day. Have a, have a wonderful time. Prayers are with you. Take care. This is Ken Jobst with a closer look.